Good morning, student. Hello, how are you? First of all, I want to tell you that I miss you so much. I hope you have a good health and a good situation. So today, our lesson for today is about fighting global warming. Here we have a new unit, right? So open your book, page 16. So what's the title of this new unit so the title of this new unit is fighting global warming right fighting global warming what does global warming mean global warming is global warming is in arabic right so here we have outcomes for this unit you will be able to predict the meanings of new vocabulary items you have to guess the meaning of a new word you have to know the meaning of a new vocabulary is right you have to guess the meaning of a new items right so the next point is that you will be able to talk about global warming using adverb of time and frequency here you have to talk about global warming about الاحتباس الحراري using what adverbs of time and frequency you will be able to know what is the adverbs of time and frequency okay so next you will be able to listen to people talking about global warming right you will be able to listen to people talking about temperature global warming earth or atmosphere okay so this is the topic of this unit right the next point is <coughs> You have or you will read an article about things you can do to save the earth. You have to imagine yourself or imagine a new, a new ideas for what? For saving the earth, right? For saving the planet, okay, student? So the next point is to practice the imperative to prepare a list of actions you have to use the imperative okay to prepare a list of actions okay and you have to write information for a poster this is the final point okay so those are the outcomes of this unit fighting global warming okay here in exercise number one you have to look to the photos and predict the what they are talking about here we have in this photo what you can see here look here we have what? Here we have drought, right? Here we have, there's no plants. There's no animals, right? There's nothing live in this place, right? So look here. What can you see here? Here you can see what? An ice, right? There is ice and water here down, right? So, look here. What can you see here in this photo, in this picture? What can you see? Here we have a storm, right? There is a strong and heavy wind. There is raining here, like, and this is wind, and this is rain. It's raining here, and here we have strong and heavy winds, right? So, here we have a storm and here we have drought and here we have ice melting in those three pictures, right? So let us listen to 
the recorder and this recorder will explain and describe those words in those words in the box okay lock to this box here we have a new words you have to guess the meaning of those new words you have to predict the meanings of those new vocabulary so let us listen to uh, a recorder and let us predict the meaning of the those new words okay so let us listen and let us start module two Page 17. Exercise 2. 1. Global warming means that the atmosphere warms up. 2. The temperature goes up every year. 3. Our planet, Earth, is in danger. 4. Global warming changes our climate. 5. Droughts are dry periods when it doesn't rain. 6. When it rains a lot, there are floods. 7. There is too much carbon dioxide in the atmosphere. 8. When the weather is violent, storms become very strong. 9. Pollution accelerates global warming. We have to slow it down. 10. The sun heats up the air and warms up the earth. 11. The ice in the poles melts because of global warming. 12. We need carbon dioxide in order not to freeze. Okay, student, here we have new words, right? Here we, ha we have new vocabularies. So, let us know the meaning of those new words, the meanings of those new vocabularies, okay? So, global warming. What is the meaning of global warming? Okay, here we have global warming. It is an increase in world temperature caused by increased amount of carbon dioxide around the earth. Global warming in Arabic means الاحتباس الحراري right in science class you talked about الاحتباس الحراري right student here we have in English global warming right an increase of or in world temperature ارتفاع في درجة حرارة العالم أو الكرة الأرضية caused by increased amount of carbon dioxide so what is the main reason for global warming it is the increasing of the amount of carbon dioxide around the earth ارتفاع نسبة ثاني أكسيد الكربون حول كوكب الأرض this is the main reason for what for global warming this is what the main reason for global warming so next earth what does earth mean here we have earth the planet we live in so earth it is in arabic kawkab al ard the planet we live in here we have in the uh, the planet here we have what plants animals water a human being okay we all live in this planet so what is the name of this planet it is the earth okay it is the earth okay student atmosphere the meaning of atmosphere is the mixture of gases that surrounding the earth the mixture of gases okay خليط من الغازات 
we have carbon dioxide, oxygen, and many other gases that surrounding the earth. Okay, student, many other gases that surrounding Mohita the Mohita uh, Bikokab Al Earth. Okay, student. Next one is the climate. Here we have climate. What is the meaning of a climate? Climate is the typical weather condition in a particular area. It is what the typical weather, the perfect weather or the ideal weather condition in a, uh, in a particular area. For example, in Jordan, here we have what? Here we have as uh, a sunny or sunny summer okay it is so hot in summer and it is cold in winter for example this is what this is the climate in jordan right this is the climate al munakh fi al urdan right it is hot in summer and cold in winter so this is what this is the climate of jordan the typical weather condition in jordan okay student the next one temperature it is a measure of how hot or cold a place or thing is it is a measure of the the hot or the hot um, the hot um, temperature or the cold temperature of a place or thing okay درجة حرارة شخص أو مكان أو شيء okay so uh, temperature is a measure of how hot or cold a place or thing is drought what is or what does drought mean it is a long period when there is a little or no rain no rain or little rain so it is what it is in Arabic, Jafaf, a long period when there is no rain, no water. It is what? It is drought. In Arabic, Jafaf, no rain or no water. A long period of time that there is no water or no rain. Storm. The next one is storm. Okay. A violent, strong wind and usually rain or snow okay it is a strong heavy violent wind okay here we have violent strong and heavy wind and usually this storm has rain or snow okay student so the next one is flood what does flood mean it is a very large amount of water and flood happened in winter or in summer or in spring or in fall it happens in winter right student it happens in winter because what uh, what does it mean? It is a large, a very large amount of water. كمية كبيرة من المياه. Okay, it happens in winter. تحدث in winter. Okay. Usually, it happens in winter. Okay, student. Carbon dioxide. What does carbon dioxide mean? The gas produced when humans and animals breathe out <coughs> it is <coughs> so we breathe what we breathe oxygen right and we release what we release carbon dioxide fanny oxide carbon right that carbon dioxide is the gas that we produce when we breathe when the animal breathe also right so Carbon dioxide is the ca gas that we produce when we breathe, okay? <coughs> violent. What does violent mean? Using physical force to hurt, damage, or kill someone. So here we use what? Here we use force, quwa, right? To hurt. Okay, to damage or to kill someone. 
اوكي فيولنت عنيف وي يوز ذس فيزيكال فورس تو هيرت تو دامج او تو كيل سمر حتى تاذي او تدمر او تقتل حدا سو ذس وورد ديسكرايب وات ديسكرايب فيولنس اوكي سو فيولنت از ذا ادجكتيف اوكي اوف ذا وورد فيولنس اوكي فيولنس از نون اند فيولنت وذ تي از ادجكتيف اوكي So here we have what the next word to rain. What does to rain mean? To rain is to fall to the ground from clouds. To rain in Arabic, tumtar, right? To fall to the ground from clouds. Okay. It is what verb, adjective, or noun. It is verb rain. Okay, tumtar. Okay, it is what it is verb. <coughs> the next word is to slow down. What does to slow down mean? To slow down means to become slower or to make something slower. To make to slow down. It is so it is so easy. Sorry, it is so easy. Right to slow down. You know what is uh, the meaning of a slow? Here we have what? Here we have slow. To slow down is to become slower or to make something slower. Okay? <coughs> to accelerate. What does? This is, I think, a new word for you, right? It is what? It is a verb, right? What does accelerate? To accelerate mean? To happen faster than usual or sooner than you expect. Okay, this is what this is the opposite of what to slow down, to happen faster. This is what to become slower, but this is the opposite of to slow down, to accelerate it is to happen faster or to become faster than usual. To to butter, to slow down, but to accelerate is to happen faster or to become faster, right, student? The next one to warm, to warm up, to become what? To become warm or to make someone or something warm. Warm, dafi in Arabic, okay? So here we have what to warm up. <coughs> to warm up, to become warm, or to make someone or something warm, right? To make something or someone warm, right? To heat up, to make something become warm or hot, the same thing, to heat, to make something become warm or hot. What does warm mean? And what does hot mean? It's mean hot or what or um, right? To freeze, to become hard and solid because the temperature is equal or below 6 percent okay so to become hard or solid okay to freeze and all in our we all in our houses has freezer right for food so we use this uh, to to freeze the food to make it hard and solid right to melt it is the opposite of to freeze to melt is to make or to become liquid. To make it liquid. What does liquid mean? Liquid in Arabic. Sa'ili. Okay. So what you can notice from this. Here we have to rain, to slow, to accelerate, to warm up, to heat, to freeze, or to melt is verb. Right? All of those words are what are verbs okay student so if you can notice here we have a global warming 
earth, atmosphere, climate, temperature, drought, storm, flood, carbon dioxide, are what all of those are nouns, okay? But here we have one adjective, which is violent, right? Which is violent.